for even the progress that we are seeing um, even uh, today. A lot of it is thanks to some of the investments that have been made uh, over the past few years uh, in putting in place the right digital infrastructure, much as it's not, um, you know, uh, comprehensive to the, you know, to, to at least to the scale that we would really want to. We still see a huge divide. I think when we look at the statistics of 3.6 billion people that are still left unconnected, the majority are on the African continent in the developing uh, countries. And so uh, that in itself um, goes a long way to show uh, that, you know, as we talk about the digital divide, as we talk about digital inclusion post the COVID world, then it becomes more and more urgent uh, for some of our economies.